Dimitri Bivol, that fighter, as he looks to be the ultimate party crasher. And distract you from the fact that Canelo is one of the most hardworking and dedicated fighters in the world. Chris can't start off short and slow because he'll be left hand off the top of the head from the time with Caleb Plant. He finally found a right hand, a hole for the right hand to the gut. Throwing that jab because when they watch back the Kovalev fight, they know of the sheer volume of punches, jabs specifically, that Kovalev was throwing. And look at him throwing. He has smart feet. Always aware of it. Canelo doing a good job blocking those, but they're always there, Sergio. There's a one two. It's as if he's just trying to find what works for him. He's tapping him, trying to find the range, trying to see what punches he can land comfortably. I'm trying to notice Canelo was landing to the left shoulder. Oh, that snuck through. Canelo starts loading up, even if you block those shots. No, no, don't, don't push him, don't push him. There's that right hand to the body. That Alvarez. But you can see when Bebo throws the one twos like this, he is scoring. A lot of power behind him. They're still having effect. Yes, yeah, Sergio, too, but he's stepping back with his hands up, which is a good thing. You know, as the last fight we see. Or get a flurry, man. I, I just, he, he's going to have a, a, a harder time doing it with Bebo, loading up on punches as well. But we haven't seen that light heavyweight power that we know he has. Chris Mannix, how do you? His jab has been active. Both these guys are very good. I like that nice right hand. Yeah, right hand to the body. You don't see, as you mentioned, a lot of fighters go to Canelo's butt. Ropes, just like that. His back touch the ropes, he's moving laterally. Canelo's been all power shots this round. It's one of his strongest attributes. Yes, it is. Now Canelo. But we've seen this before with Canelo Alvarez, where he's bite. Last round it was Bebo who was close. Overhand rights being landed by Canelo. Oh, look at Bebo. Look at him go. Oh, my word, Bebo. He can stay in this fight. Another good jab, and then more of it as he tried to wave Bebo back in, but Bebo not having it. And the re Finishing off with a straight right hand is Bebo, and again he connects. The uppercut that was successful early on in this fight. There is one. For Dimitri Bebo, at this point, absolutely not. He seems un- And he's looking to set this right hand up. Came around the guard with a left hook right there. Staying as sharp as he is. I see the same thing, and I might even a little bit of frustration. We know Canelo can close rounds as well. Let's take a look at our CompuBox numbers as people now. It's ready. That's exactly the game plan that Canelo had against Cal. I like that right hook to the body right there. Entire game plan coming in. Exactly. See, he's blocking every punch. Look, he's been under like four punches. In. One thing I've noticed. Bruising and redness on the face of Canelo Alvarez. Bebo looks much better. Having more success landing punches than really anyone I've seen since Gennady Golovkin back in 2000. Bebo is giving us great combinations, but he's stopping Canelo from throwing. So Canelo doesn't have... Canelo oh, missed. Right hand. Asian this ball. Some concern from Eddie Reynoso. There has been concern in that corner in the last three rounds. Let's check in with Chris Mannix. He has been excellent. He is overwhelming Canelo with the sheer volume of his punches. This is just... This is the second foray into light heavyweight division for Canelo. He's a natural light heavyweight, so guarding, putting his earmuff defense in is good enough for him because he's... Three rounds to go. Jack. Look at the punches through round nine. My word, 110 to 61. Draw in that fight, but Bebo, he looks like he's winning it. Counter right hand. I feel like he knows it's a large possibility he may be down.
letting himself be in Canelo's range, maybe because he's... Dave Moretti, Steve Weisgold, who I consider the gold standard when it comes to stepping back and always staying in control, not giving up control. Oh. Finesse and a game plan and technique and a strategy and discipline. So he doesn't get out of character. There's a right. Not take any more chances. He did exactly what he did. Was Bebo just too big and just too strong? Well, one of those shots could have went down. Very strong chip from Canelo. Right hand for Canelo. Jabs and showed up. And May have just beaten the pad for Canelo King. You accomplished what you signed up for. You came.